What's up guys and welcome back to another quick view. My name is Ben and I'm gonna try and keep this one short. But this week's topic is gonna be camera tracking. So essentially with camera tracking, there are a few different options. There's something known as outside in and there's something known as inside out. With outside in, you have multiple cameras looking at one object and all these different cameras are triangulating the position and rotation and stuff like that of this object as it moves through 3D space and it transmits that XYZ positional data to the computer so that you can track it through your scene in real time. In our case, we use an inside out tracker, which is essentially there are multiple different tracking points in our ceiling. Uh, you can also use them on the floor. And then we have uh, a camera that sits on top of our camera looking up into the ceiling. Uh, we use the MOSIS star tracker uh, and we call the stars on the ceiling the constellation. MOSIS. That's it, right? Okay, anyways. <laughs> so we got MOSIS here. Uh, the main components are our actual camera, which shoots up to the stars and gets the actual tracking data. We have the computer down here which has uh, Ethernet going here to get the actual uh, signal to the router. And then the router goes to our network, which goes to our computers, which is how we connect to Unreal Engine via plugin. It's pretty complicated. It's not just this box. It's more than this. It's very heavy. So whenever you're building out, you know, it's not gimbal friendly. So that's all important information. All right, so what you guys are looking at right now is an infrared signal coming out of the infrared LEDs on the MOSIS star tracker. And you can see those little red circles up top. Uh, those are the stars. So that is what the camera is actually looking for. Uh, we have optical good on the screen. So that tells us that we can see enough stars that the camera knows where it is uh, in 3D space, which is pretty cool. We uh, covered it right here and now it said lost and now we're back to optical good. So this is, uh, this is it, this is the Moses. So that is all that we have for you guys this week. Uh, hopefully now you have a little bit better of an understanding of what camera tracking is and how it is used in the ICVFX world. And uh, if you guys learned something, please consider hitting that subscribe button and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.